In this question, a vertical scan through the beginning of the answer choices reveals a split among due to, because and because of. There is a conceptual attack behind this, but we'll come back to that because there is another obvious split at the end of these answer choices between limits and limit. This is an obvious trigger to check for subject verb agreement. But one has to be careful when applying subject verb agreement here because we have a that in all these answer choices. That means we have a relative clause starting here. And we can also notice that there is a prepositional phrase before this relative clause. So when a relative clause follows a prepositional phrase, we have to be very careful about what the number of the verb has to be. Because, for example, we can say the box of toffees which were made of caramel is missing. Similarly, the box of toffees which was made of cardboard is missing. So notice how the main verb in both these sentences is is because the subject here is the box. But in the relative clause we have were a plural verb and was a singular verb. So both of them are fine in this case because when we see the logic of the relative clause which were made of caramel it becomes apparent that it is referring to toffees. And in this case the cardboard is referring to the box. So the box is singular, so a singular verb here, and toffee is plural, so a plural verb here. So please keep in mind that the verb in the relative clause will completely depend on what the logic is referring to. So accordingly, when we check the answer choices, we have this logic that something limits the species from spreading, and we just need to check the prepositional phrase for what is limiting the spread. And it's logically understood that this relative clause should not be referring to the kind, it should be referring to the fierce intercolony struggles and this is a plural noun. Because it's the struggles that are limiting the spread of the species and because it's plural, the singular verbs are out. So we're down to B and D. Now we can utilize the difference between due to and because. So this is how because, because of and due to work. Because is something that connects two clauses together. It's the conjunction that connects two clauses together. So we can say he got a great score because he worked hard. So in this case, because is connecting this clause and this clause. Because of, on the other hand, is used to connect. a clause and a noun. So we can say he got a great score because of his hard work. So we can see that his hard work is a noun phrase here. So this connection is perfectly grammatical. And due to is something that connects a noun to another noun. So it might sound okay to say he got a great score due to his hard work. But you can sort that confusion out by reading due to as caused by. So would it make sense to say he got a great score caused by his hard work? Obviously not, right? So the right way of putting that would be his great score was, now we need a helping verb here to make this a proper sentence. So his great score was due to his hard work. So his great score is a noun phrase. And his hard work is also a noun phrase and that's what due to should connect. So if we check in B, we have due to it something. Now this is a noun phrase. The and considers all of its fellows. So that is a clause construction. So we have a noun phrase and a clause construction that is connected by due to. And that goes off as well. So the right answer choice should be D for delta.